Today I'll be showing you Amanda by John Reno in the new color Soul Dress. Hey guys, welcome. So I'm bringing this review for name brand wigs. So be sure to head over and check those guys out and also if you ever have any wig related questions you can hit them up at support at name brand wigs. They are always ready and willing to help. The customer service there is amazing. I love name brand wigs and I also have a coupon code that you can use there at name brand wigs. It is Kim30 and you can save 30% off on selected brands so be sure to check in my description box which brands that code's good for. Oh my gosh y'all this color this color this color is amazing it is so beautiful this color is beautiful this is another new one from John Reno part of their cascading color collection I have showed you guys two others it was fawn and sunshine and now Soltress. I don't know. I don't know which one to choose for my favorite out of the three. There are six in that collection. I have three of them and oh my gosh, I can only imagine, I can only imagine what the other three are. These are amazing. When I put this one on, my husband was like, wow, 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 wow. I think that's my favorite. He loves this color combination going on here. It is just absolutely gorgeous. I have to agree. I love it as well. I don't... I'm loving fun as well and I'm loving sunshine too. So I'm just... I just love these cascading colors, guys. They are so gorgeous. This one comes in 37 colors, including their California Blonde Collection and their Cascading Color Collection. So, hey, there's colors for us all. I love when we have a lot of color selections because so many of us are so different and we like what we like. But I also like having that selection because sometimes I just like to get out of my comfort zone and get in there and get me an auburn or a brunette or just go right out platinum blonde or whatever. But with these new cascading colors, whew, you kind of get a two for one. <laughs> I mean, just the way that the darker fades into the light. They are gorgeous, guys. Okay, let's talk a little bit about Amanda here. Amanda is, as you can see, a long layered style here. <laughs> that is gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. She features a double monofilament top. She has what... <laughs> I would describe as being a very mini, mini, mini small lace right here at the front. It goes almost temple to temple around. It is just enough just to give you that little bit of extension from that mono top to graduate down. Personally, I would prefer just a full lace front. Even though this looks really, really nice, I just like to have enough lace front to where I can glue it down. And normally I use like it's got to be glue or it stays or something like that because I wear the longer styles mostly for date night or special occasions and I like that added security. If I'm out because I am a talker <laughs> and I'm constantly touching my hair and I'm doing things because I talk with my hands as well, I like to be able to glue that lace front down and it also helps it really blend into my skin very natural looking so I feel more confident and I think there may be just enough lace to where I could possibly glue that down I have not tried it right now I don't really need to 
but she has a double monofilament top, which is amazing, amazing. The parting looks so real. That parting is so beautiful. You so with that monofilament top up here it's going to allow that parting on the left right or the center whichever you like now when i did get this one i did have to train it and what i did because it wanted to fall right down into my face and it's kind of still doing it i haven't completely got it to where i want it but to help train those bangs what you can do is just spritz it down with some water in the front and twist it twist that bang back, clip it, leave it on your wig head, and just go. Or for me, what I did is I spritzed it down with some water. I already had it on my head, and I clipped it back, and I went about and did my business through, you know, for a couple hours as I was just cleaning house and doing chores or whatever it needed to be done. And by the time it was time to do review, I unclipped it and it is actually staying back. And I also added some synthetic safe hairspray on it to, to help it stay back as well. So, I mean, it's fine. It's, it's working just fine. Okay, let's take a look at the inside of Amanda's cap. Amanda has this beautiful double monofilament top here. This creates a very natural looking scalp when you do the parting to the left right or center these double monofilament are lovely they are so beautiful now this is the little lace front that i was telling you guys about it is very very small but just enough to blend in to making it look more natural here at the hairline she has belt bendable ear tabs, those adjustable straps here, felt nape, and she's open wefted throughout the rest of her cap. And I will say this girl has the most stretch in one of the wigs that I have gotten in a while. She's got quite a bit of stretch. Amanda's bangs are 12 inches. The crown is 17 inches, the sides are 11 inches, and the nape is 17 inches. And she weighs 5.5 ounces. And she has an average size cap. I have a petite size head measuring 21 inches in circumference. So yes, I most definitely on this one, I had to really, really use those adjustable straps and tighten them up to fit my petite size head. Okay, let's take a look at her all the way around. This girl is so, so pretty, y'all. This, this is something that I gravitate toward. I love the long styles. I love the bang. However, I may, I don't know, I don't know. I may go and have even a little bit more of a curtain bang cut into this one. I just think it would look really, really good with more of a curtain bang, just a little bit shorter. I don't know. I, I, I just love her so much. I will usually keep my wigs, you know, week two, two, three weeks, wear it a good while before I go and actually have them cut because it doesn't grow back. So I really want to make sure that's exactly what I want. And then there are some times that I will get those wigs that I'm like, yeah, this one really just has to be cut or thinned out or whatever. Just make sure that 
if you don't know how to do it, take it to someone that does know how to do it so that you do not mess up your beautiful investment and your beautiful hair. I also wanted to mention that the side coverage on me, on my petite size head anyways, is beautiful. It is so well done, guys. It is so well done with how that just goes down. Just probably need to lay those ear tabs a little bit more, but it would look so beautiful pulled back because you, I have that coverage here. Oh, that is so pretty, and this color is oh, so pretty. The color Sultrist has cool, dark roots that gradually lighten to a chic shock a platinum blonde. Wow, wow, wow. It's beautiful. This color is available in most of John Renault's popular long wig styles. So I love that. I, I am really loving Amanda. Hey, my friends. Oh, my word. So it has been a few days or even longer since I made my review on Amanda, and I'm playing with her again today. I've been doing holiday looks and glam shots and just plain, and I had to get back on here and show y'all what I did with Amanda. Wow, she is so, so pretty, y'all. I love this. I think that she is a perfect, perfect holiday style. And I'm not even done yet. I'm going to try to do other styles with her. But for now, I'm really, really loving her just like this. I changed the part, swept her over, flipped my head, flipped it back up, put some hairspray on her. And here it is. Also glammed my makeup up. I was like looked at myself in the mirror and I was like, who that? <laughs> I don't know who you are, but I like it. It is so, so fun, guys, to change our makeup, to change our hair, our clothes, to get, I mean, for me, I'm a girly girl, even though I live on the farm. Most of the time I'm either in sweatpants or jeans and boots because I'm out out taking care of animals or running around doing something so it feels good to glam up and to change my look and just just to have fun and be a girl so these wigs are allowing me to do that gosh I love them I love my hair I love my hair Thank you guys so much for joining me today. But before you go, be sure to subscribe, share, like, and comment. And you can find me over on Instagram and Facebook at Let's Talk With Kim. See you all soon in my next video.